Your first mission has been a success. The museum has been saved, and another very rare piece has been added to the collection. Watatlan's mask has finally been assembled. No other acquisition will rival this gem of a piece. Well, and goody. Now, let's see what we have We've done an process. excellent job, my friend. We? But we've got to set off again as soon as possible. The organization needs to contact us. Get under the dome now. There's something I want you to know. It could be a highly dangerous mission. Once you know what this is all about... The watchman of the Volstead Brewery in Chicago had reportedly seen figures moving around stealthily and heard some shooting. The new owner's body was found lying in a mash tun, and the judicial authorities jumped to the conclusion that it was a gangland killing. No bullets were found, either in the victim's body or anywhere else. A new owner and the takeover of the ex-distillery by a brewer are the only recent changes that have happened at Volstead. William Bernst will go on this mission with you again. Okay. Yeah, I think that's it. Whiskey a go go. All right. There's been loss of life here. The entity we're up against is very powerful. The organization has supplied us with weapons. Take them now. Now listen carefully. The experience level you've reached allows you to use new spells, but be careful with them. They're all heavy on energy. Okay. Is he done? Hmm. Weird. Sometimes the text disappears when people are talking. It's, uh, well, weird. At least when Burns talks, he used to, well, you know, have a text crawl or something. Well, anyway, you are supposed to take all these weapons, and believe me, you need every one of them. Because if you start a mission without taking these weapons, you will never ever get a new one. You need to take every one of them. And one more thing before we go off to whiskey a go go. This PK blaster, only use it for the boss fight, because you can never reload this thing. And I don't know why, but you can never reload it for some reason. So, once you have wasted all hit the, those bullets, then it's gone. Well, yeah, and also level up your blast, positive blast to, um, mm, let's see, two, and you will probably need grain and heal at the start. The rest of the spells, like gate and well, Exorcist and Sea Spirit, are you only going to need at the last, well, uh, last thing in this Some level. Some objects are under spells. You'll have to resort to an exorcism before you can handle or use them. Yeah, what he said. You know that the Beyond's creatures are invisible to the great majority of people. Even we occasionally have to resort to a sea spirit in order to visualize some very powerful species. The gate is a special spell. We use it to open the very doors we guard and enter the beyond. Sometimes it's the only way to find the entities we're hunting. Okay. I'll have more to tell you when we get there. Okay. Well, anyway, let's go to Chicago. seems to be a beer factory or maybe whiskey I don't know we're running out of time the weapons supplied by the organization will be heavy on energy only 10 highly powerful shots can be fired from the PK blaster save it to fight the strongest entity hmm this Bear bottle looks strange. Maybe I can take it. I can. Hmm. I don't seem to be able to take these bear bottles. And I don't know what I'm supposed to have all these bear bottles for, but uh. To build up our energy yeah. reserves again, we can hook up to the H networks. 
use a drain spell. One thing to remember is that the is Yeah. Try not to get injured. If you do get hurt, perform a heal. We'll okay. have to split up the positions. We'll search the place for clues. Did I tell you I like bear? <laughs> you like bear? <laughs> okay. Well, you know, Berms. Here. Have a beer. I don't really need it. Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see what I can do. Well, I think there is energy on um, on this place. Yes, there is 55 in energy, and this is called the entrance hall. Also, a thing that I need to mention before we go any further. In every room, there is... Um, number and this number that you are looking at this 55 number is how much energy there is in the room if it is zero energy then you can't drain the place from energy and trust me when i say it you will need every single drop of energy or power because your energy level will drain out very very fast because of all the spells and so forth. <laughs> now, there are very powerful each networks in there. We need to find what the entity haunting the place draws its energy from and look at its items. I don't think I should use a grenade just yet. Oh, the bear bottle has gone to the floor. <laughs> Weird. Alright then, this game is glitchy. And in this room you will find an enemy, which will shoot you the first thing he does. And there he is! He's a mafia! many shots do I need to have? Let's do a heal, like that, and now try to attack him again. He doesn't seem to die pretty easy. Man, this hit detection is off. the health spell, quickly. I know. I will hide in this room. Oh, man. Oh, a bear bottle. Hmm. This map looks suspicious. Let's take it. Okay, it's a factory plan. Oh. The detects really the need to be wired. Show some warehouses and a basement adjoining the factory. No information on how to gain access. Okay. Hmm. Nothing in this there room. There must be some electrical which opens the oh, way to the warehouses. Bottle. Access to the lower ground floor must also be possible. Hmm. Okay. Don't you ever die, stupid ghost. Will you die already? How many lives does that thing have? Man, this hit detection is off! I'm so tired of that ghost that I'm going to use a grenade to blow the fuck away him. Uh, let's see, a grenade? No, that was not a grenade. Ah, there you go, a grenade. Now you'll get your own medicine, a stupid mafia ghost. Die! Oh, finally, he died. Or. Oh, well, thank God. 
<sighs> Let's drain this place of energy. Isn't it the weird? The always locked. Damn it, there must be some way of getting in. The place is swarming with negative energies. We'll have to economize energy. Yeah, yeah. Isn't it weird that the ghost didn't attack William Burns? You know, do you think there can be some conspiracy between William Burns and the ghosts? I mean, I'm just saying. The ghost doesn't seem to attack William Burns, but everyone seems to attack me for some reason. Oh, thank God. And for some reason as well, they all seem to be so powerful, and I seem to be so weak. It's weird. Now let's go into another room as the other rooms there are always one ghost and here is this ghost. They are sometimes visible like there. And he died. If you're wondering how you can be sure that you kill the ghost, well, they usually make some kind of ah, sound whenever they die. But uh, not always. But, uh, yeah, that's how you know how you know that you have killed them. Well, yeah. Anyhow, you are going to press this button here. You are pressing it the same w way you are opening doors, so... Yeah. And now I activated the electric motor. So, what this means is... Well, literally, that I opened the factory doors. And I open a hell lot more of ghosts that can kill me. Because inside the factory is two more ghosts, one in every room, and also a key that we are going to need. And here is another ghost. Bye, fucker. What the fuck? He didn't die? Oh my goodness! How mu much health bar does these things have? Uh, where's my heal spell? Ah, uh, man! So unfair! They have so much health! Well... Die already! <sighs> you know what? I'm going to use another grenade on that thing because I want to have it away! Man! It's so unfair and I'm down to two grenades! I hope this one will do the trick! Did he die? I don't know. I don't really know. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. These enemies are getting on my nerves. <laughs> anyway, you see this floating key that you are going to need, well, uh, to open uh, uh, the caravan. The caravan which is locked. Well, you can't touch this key, because if you do, then you're going to, like that, fall backwards. So what you need to do, is you need to use the Exorcist spell. So now we're going to equip the Exorcist spell, and use it on the key. And what will happen is, the key will fall to the floor, or on the box in this case. And you can't actually take it. Now we have taken the key. And let's see. Let's see. Hmm. Well, that was the f another knife throwing ghost. Hmm. I'm guessing that they are recycling the enemies 
to this level. I mean, well, we have one. Well, yeah, I might be just nitpicking. Okay. Uh, seems like my um, blaster was locked on. Hmm, or something. I was finding a lot of blasts after he died. It might just be a glitch. I think I should take this bear bottle. I don't know why I should have all these bear bottles. Maybe they are good for protection or if this priest will be thirsty for some beer? Hmm. Now well, let's just wait for the ghost to appear. It takes about maybe some, a minute and there they are. And there is the third withdrawing ghost. Wow, that was easy. Anyway, now we should go in here. And throw a grenade because here it's another ghost that needs to be killed. And there he is. Just throw the grenade and. What the heck? Bear bottle? But I. Throw a grenade at him. What the heck? How could. How could a bear. Grenade transform into a bear? Well, after killing that ghost that you just saw, I'm going to go to the caravan to get some things that I need. Mainly, a pack of cards. And you will see why those cards are needed. Okay... Um, it was just a minor glitch. Like I said before, this game is glitchy. Apparently you can... <laughs> Go through a door and end up in a wall somewhere else. <laughs> anyway, you're supposed to use this key, which I having a trouble of using. <laughs> Slippery hands. Anyway, you should use this key that you picked up earlier and use it to open the caravan, like you are seeing here. And just to show you. There is a book here. See this book? You are not supposed to take this book because this book is a bug. If you take this book, you will not be able to finish this level. Yeah, they are that mean, these game designers. Why put in a book that can literally destroy the game or literally make you not be able to finish this level? Man! So. All you really need to do is to do exorcism on this pack of cards, like so, and then you will be able to take them. But I think I should take this newspaper, because um, you can take that just for information. It's really not that important, it's just information. Um, okay, maybe you don't need to take the pack of Ernie, cards. in the basement. Hmm. Oh, I shouldn't have interrupted him. Um, uh, anyway, I think I need this pack of cards, but... Uh, somehow, Ernie is dying. <laughs> A gate. Uh, or was it Williams? I'm not sure what killed him. The newspaper records that you transferred all deal with the same thing. The crimes of a certain Ernie Williams, known as Nasty Ernie. He was a notorious mobster back in the Prohibition era, and he's been dead for over 60 years. Aha, uh -huh. so it's him who has killed. Okay, thanks a lot. William Burns performed the gate and entered the beyond. The entity must be hiding there somewhere. If it actually is, don't forget that fighting an entity in the beyond is no mean feat. You have to remove it from there. What information was returned by William Burns before he died shows that a highly powerful Hartman network does exist. It accounts for the hostile presence. 
to find the way to the beyond. Yeah, like you said, you can't fight the ghost in the beyond because they are too strong there. So now you are going to do a gate to enter the beyond you're and... In the beyond. It voila! Very hard to contact you. <laughs> look! The a car! Very a Royce Royce! How did he get that down here? The entity must be here somewhere. <laughs> Funny place. I always Before wanted a Rolls Royce in spell. my basement. <laughs> so, okay. So there is what am I looking for? Poker, man. <laughs> Call it for a ghost. Well, what do you, you know? You still owe me some big money, don't you? I'll just have to check my plan. what? <laughs> my book here. Anyway, you're supposed to k take this black book, and um, once you take it, do a gate and run! <laughs> and from here on, it's just a battle between you and the boss. And this battle will go on forever. Uh, I, I really mean it, it's just that tedious get through, I mean, oh, man, <sighs> it's like it never ends, so, until the end, this is just me running, healing myself, shooting the ghost, and the ghost is flying through the walls, and the graphics are clicking through, man, <laughs> really glitchy game. When I first played this game, I was actually afraid of this boss, ba uh, boss the battle because it was so horrible looking. This um, boss, boss, and the battle.
Gentlemen, I owe him. You've completed another mission. Mission's Ernie completed. Williams is gone for good. The unfortunate death of William Burns means what? that you'll be on your own from now on. Thanks a lot. This organization is really nice to me. Uh, anyway, see you next time. This is Singborg over and out.